Hey guys, it's me, Coco on one o three o seven, and um, here is a update video, and I'm gonna talk to you guys about a couple of things. Um, yeah, Gabe right here. Um, yeah, let me just get going with what I want to say. First of all, sorry I'm on here in my bonnet. Um, I have some conditioner on my hair, and I'm just really having some hair confusion type moments like I don't know what I want to do to it I have no clue I'm really trying to avoid putting um putting hair in there but I think I might just do it anyway because I don't know what natural styles I want to wear stop yeah I don't know what natural styles I want to wear so but yeah that's that now um since we've been in the house, been in the house now for our, not even too much yet, but I've been saying that I want to get back to my weight loss journey. Um, and sadly, I'm like really ashamed and disappointed to say I haven't, re I haven't got back on track. Not even really. I haven't got back on track yet. I made a video a few weeks ago saying, you know, that I want to do this and I want to do that. And I haven't done a darn thing and I just really feel terrible about it. Um, number one, I want to say... I know I mentioned I was going to be doing P90X and I was going to be working with a friend and doing it, but I really think to recommit myself to my journey, I need to, um, I don't really need to rely on anybody. I need to kind of venture out and get this done on my own. And not to say that um, she hasn't been a good support system or um, she hasn't been willing to help me or anything or let me use her videos or nothing like that. But it's just when you want something done, you kind of have to do it yourself. I don't want to, um, I don't want to get back on this journey and be in a position where I'm like, well, if I can't get to her, then I can't do this. Or if she can't come over here to me, then I can't do this. Or, you know, anything like that. I just want to be able to get up, do the things I need to do, um, depend on myself and doing it and, you know, get to the goal that I want to get to. Um... What else? I know once upon a time I was talking about a few, well, it's probably in the video I did a few weeks ago. I was saying how the hubby is on his challenge to gain weight and to put on more muscle. Um, he has been very successful in doing that. He's been working on his weight gain and muscle gain for about a month now and within that month he's put on about 15 pounds and you know he's looking really solid like people that know us and know him and if he's hanging out in the house he'll be around the house maybe with no shirt on if somebody comes over they can really tell they're like you are getting bigger you know in the shoulder area and he's like naturally a really skinny guy so yeah you can tell he's meeting his goal and um Honestly, that makes me feel even worse about my whole journey and not being on track like I should be because he's getting the things done that he wants to do. And I know he'll tell me anyway that he wants to look good for me. And I kind of feel like, you know, I'm letting myself down, but I'm letting him down. He's not saying that, but, you know, because I just be doing more. You know, he wants to look his best for me and I should be putting in just as much effort. And, um, that's kind of on a personal tip, but yeah, I am just putting it out there. Um, any of you ladies out there married or not married or whatever, you know, you have, um, a significant other or whatever the case may be. Sometimes I think that you might kind of have to think about them too, because you want to look good for them. I'm sure they want to look good for you. You know, it's, it's a, it's a shared thing. I don't know how else to put it. So, um, that's kind of been having me feeling some kind of way about my whole journey. And it's really making me want to do what I have to do and push and go the extra step, go the extra mile and just get this done. All I want to say, uh, I think that was about it. Now, for those of you that have been watching, watching my channel for a while and keeping up with it with my whole weight loss journey, you saw a few, a couple months ago, I did a bathing suit challenge. Okay. I was in, um, it was a two-piece, but it was like a shirt type thing, bathing suit. Well, guess what? Um, we went to Lake Lanier last week, and I wore a two-piece, like full-blown two-piece out there. But I wore a cover-up on top of it. Now, before we left and before I put on my cover-up, I snapped 
two pictures of me in this um, bathing suit wearing the cover up. And I was like, I should post this. And then, well, initially I said I should put this on my Facebook. But then I got a little freaked out about it. Like, no, I'm not going to... Like, no, I'm not going to put this on my Facebook. But in just a split decision type thing, I've decided, is that the right word, a split decision? Whatever. I decided that I'm going to post it in this video right now just to put myself out there. And here it is. Not like I look like some kind of supermodel in this two-piece bathing suit. I decided to post it because I just felt like I really wanted to get myself out there. And this is how I look right now in a two-piece. And I know I can look better and I'm going to look better. And yeah, I just want to put it out there. Um, i let you guys see how I look right now. And, you know, maybe this is bathing suit challenge number two. You know, that's the picture from now. And maybe in a few months. I'll come back and I'll put the same bathing suit back on and show you guys how I look and my improvements. Okay, so subscribe. If you're not a subscriber, subscribe because I'm going to be doing a lot more videos and I'm going to really be aggressive with my weight loss um, this ground. And um, comment and, you know, just keep sending me your positive thoughts. And if you're on a weight loss journey, um, keep good luck on your journey. And if you slipped up like I have and fell off for whatever reason, you know, just get back on there. Um, and the important thing is don't be in denial about what's going on. And a lot of us get in denial. I know I've been in denial before saying, oh, I'm still doing good or I'm still doing that when I know I'm not doing my putting my all into it. So I think it's a lot easier to get back on track when you actually say I'm not doing what I'm supposed to be doing then you can really have a fresh start. So, um, yeah, that's what I'm doing. Let me wrap up this video. I will see you guys later, or you will see me later. Bye.